Hi, I'm Dr. Brittany Bankson with Arosti. Today we'll be discussing Thoracic Outlet Syndrome, or TOS for short. In this video, we'll talk about the causes of Thoracic Outlet Syndrome, a few signs and symptoms that may indicate that you have this condition, as well as how traditional healthcare handles it and what makes us at Arosti a little different. Let's get started. So what is Thoracic Outlet Syndrome, or TOS? It's a narrowing of the thoracic outlet, which is the space between the collarbone and the first rib. This causes compression to blood vessels and nerves that supply the arm. Some common causes of this condition are a trauma such as a car accident, repetitive usage at the computer or overhead positions, and occasionally a structural abnormality. Signs and symptoms of TOS include pain or numbness and tingling in the shoulder, upper arm traveling into the forearm, and even into the hands and fingers. We'll also see a loss of grip strength. We see this oftentimes with desk workers at the computer for too long, or even jobs such as painters or mechanics where they have their arms overhead for long periods of time. This causes tightening of the neck muscles and the pec muscles and causes poor posture, and this suffocates the nerves and the blood vessels that supply the arm, causing that numbness and tingling. Let's talk about how traditional healthcare handles TOS. If you went to your primary healthcare provider, they may want to do diagnostic imaging, such as an X-ray, an MRI, or a nerve study. They may recommend over-the-counter or prescription pain or nerve medication to help decrease your symptoms. While these steps can help, sometimes we see patients come into our office that are still experiencing certain levels of numbness and tingling in their hands. So let's talk about how our Rossi is a little different. Each visit is a whole hour long, one-on-one. -on -one. The first half is with me. I do a very thorough examination to get down to the root cause of your condition. I then do a very specific manual therapy, all with my thumbs, to address any tight tissue that's causing pain or restriction in range of motion. Right afterwards, we go to the rehab side. That's where you have a couple things you can do at home to release that tight tissue on your own, as well as strengthen any weak areas leading to your condition. This is that one-two punch that we need to not only get you feeling better faster, but keep it good for the long haul. Thanks for checking out this video, and we hope it was helpful. If you or anyone you know is suffering from thoracic outlet syndrome or any other aches or pains, please reach out to Arosti for help. And if you want to check out some great videos, click up here and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more information. See you next time.